Paneer pakoras are the easiest when it comes to cooking something delicious and quick for your snack. The amazing taste and the softness of the paneer along with the flavors gives the best combo to your taste buds. So let's just start. I've cut the paneer in cubes and now I'm just going to slit it from the center and cut it into two slices like this. I'm going to use some coriander mint chutney or you can use date and tamarind chutney or even garlic chutney and all these chutneys are there on our channel so you can check it out. And then I'm going to apply a thin layer of the chutney in the center and sandwich the paneer. In this way, I'm going to make all the paneer sandwiches. The paneer slices are ready and now I'm going to make the batter. For that I have some gram flour. I'm going to season it with salt, turmeric powder, just a little bit, red chilli powder, coriander and cumin seed powder, coriander leaves and I'm going to add some water and make the batter, not a very thick batter and this is the consistency of the batter that I need. A nice pouring consistency batter. The batter is ready and time to fry the paneer now. For that, I'm going to dip every paneer sandwich. Just dip a few pieces in the batter. Coat it nicely with the batter. And now I'm going to fry these pieces. I have a pan over here in which I've heated some oil. And now I'm going to drop these paneer pieces. Toss a little bit of oil on top and flip them over. Time to get these pakoras out. Drain the oil. The pani pakoras are ready. And I'm going to plate them in this nice bowl which has been gifted by my friend. And I'm also going to sprinkle them with a little bit of chaat masala to give it that added zing. Here you go. My yummy paneer pakoras are ready. Serve them hot with ketchup or chutney along with a cup of tea and enjoy your evening to the hill. Subscribe to Rajshree Food. Till then, bye-bye.